Hello from Jonathan and from me, welcome to the programme. Now he was the 100th British soldier to die this year in Afghanistan and today Lance Corporal Adam Drain of the Royal Anglians was laid to rest in Bury St Edmunds. Hundreds of people turned out to share in his family's grief and pay tribute to a man described as an outstanding young soldier. Victoria Webb was at the service and she sent us this report. As the people of Bury St Edmunds lined the streets by St Mary's Church, a mother, father, brother and fiancé escorted the coffin of the young man they all loved dearly. This was to be a public funeral and a chance for the public to show their support for Lance Corporal Adam Drain's family. Everyone's wanting to pay their respects to a young man who's laid down his life effectively for us. It's quite sad, but it's lovely to see such a turnout for a local boy. So it's quite sad. I'm sad. I didn't know him. I believe the people of Bury St Edmunds are very proud of Adam and all of his colleagues who are here today. Um, they're very sombre and feeling for the family. It's a very sad time of year. The uncle of Adam's fiance, a Royal Anglian himself, spoke of the family's grief. Adam died doing the job he so dearly loved and the family will always be so proud of not only Adam but his comrades too. More than 700 people attended today's service, among them Corporal Drain's comrades. Some of them had been injured in this current tour. Hundreds of people have lined the streets here today to pay their respects to a young man from Stanningfield near Bury St Edmunds who was well known and respected across the battalion and who had a bright future ahead of him. With so many people wishing to pay their respects, the service was relayed to the crowd outside the Athenaeum. How proud we hear the people of Suffolk, indeed the people of this country, are of your son. David Pooley, a close friend of the family, spoke on their behalf. He told the congregation how 23-year-old Corporal Drain was a music lover, a keen skateboarder and boxer who became a member of the 1st Battalion of the Royal Anglians in 2007 and just two weeks later joined them on tour in Afghanistan. None of us will ever forget Adam or the 7th of December 2009 and the ultimate sacrifice that he made on that day. Adam, thank you for being big part of our lives. You're a special person and we're going to miss you. Corporal Drain was shot at a checkpoint in Helmand Province on the 7th of December. He was the 100th British soldier to be killed in Afghanistan this year. Madam always had a joke for people uh, and always tried to keep a smile on his face. Uh, he was a very professional soldier um, and he certainly had a, a bright future ahead of him in, in our regiment. After the service, Corporal Drain's family and close friends left for a private burial in his home village of Stanningfield. A final farewell just two days before Christmas. Victoria Webb, Anglia News, Bury St Edmunds. A funeral there of Lance Corporal Adam Drain.